Nelty Kaini here, second year BS Ed English. And I am here to do a progress vlog on my diorama making for CPE 107. I will be making a triorama. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this will look like a pyramid type of diorama. And the topic that I will be tackling using this diorama is the Freytag's Pyramid, the one that is used to teach the plot structure of a story. It's usually used in literature. This was taught to me by one of my teachers back in senior high school when I was in 11th grade. So I will go back to that lesson and we will be making a diorama out of it. So. You know, get on to business. But before that, before we actually do the uh, creation process, let me introduce my materials. So, first one we will be using construction papers. I have like a, an entire ring with, me with like assorted colors. I bought this from Kristan Bookstore. And I forgot how much this cost because it's already been in my drawers for quite some time now. So yeah, we have that. Also, we have uh, assorted colored markers. I have 24 colors with me. I also have a pencil case with several markers, black markers. You can use this later. I also have like a few highlighters if that even useful to us later probably will use that too we also have blue pencil as a we cannot make things permanently all at once i also have like scissors i don't know if i already mentioned that but yeah, i have scissors and lastly to put our triorama on we have an illustration board this is size one fourth so yeah okay so let's get on to creation practice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Daming singit mo pa yun na. Okay, how to make a triorama? Pyramid. Okay. What I would do next is I would get a sheet of construction paper. We have like legal size or like a folio size na. Uh, construction paper and then we'll fold it into squares like that the one i'm doing in the video in the video tapos we will be cutting the um, excess edge of the uh, construction paper so that we will be left with the square piece so i also do that with the blue one mm -hmm. thus Jenna part, I was figuring out how to fold the square parts. I was a bit confused as to how it would work. And then I figured it out after searching it on Google by the laptop beside me. Oh my gosh, did that, did that sound right? I don't know. So yeah, and I'm starting to fold the paper now also got a yellow one and cut a square piece from it also and I cut the uh, excess 
excess piece. And so, balik tayo. I also got a purple one because uh, the pyramid diorama or the triorama has like four panels of the triangular shapes. Hindi ko din siya masabi na 3D, but you get the point. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh my gosh, this is such a boring voiceover. And so. And so we cut it in the middle. We like uh, divide it into diagonals. We fold it into diagonals and then we uh, cut like a portion of the diagonal. And so we glue like a side of the part na nagupit natin. And then we will like enfold triangle, making that that shape. Para siyang side ng pyramid, pero like. Papasok. And then, we do the same with the purple one. We also glue one side of the diagonal. And then, we fold it inwards. Ayan. And then, we do the same process with the yellow and the pink ones. So, the pink one is there. It's being glued. Yeah, so, and the process goes on until we complete the four panels of the pyramid diorama or the triorama. Watch as I finish the rest of the uh, triangular portions of the pyramid diorama or the triorama in a much speedier speed. This is me doing some markings on where I will put the texts and other drawings that I will be putting later on. You, you, you see me doing it on the pink triangular portion of the pyramid diorama. To continue the making of my diorama, I decided to change the location which I'm making it. So I decided to do it on the second floor of our other house. Char. Hindi bito other house naman. Char ko lang yun. But yeah, in the second floor of somewhere. So yeah, and that's me assembling the pyramid diorama. So you see it taking shape already. I am putting some texts labeling the uh, parts of the plot diagram structure that is being tackled in the freight experiment so that's the goal and finish 